Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another episode of Drive Time with Alec. I'm Alec. It's a pleasure to see you guys today. Welcome to Tactical Tuesdays. We're going to get tactical on your ass today. That's right. I said ass. Don't like to do it. Sometimes you got to do it. Sometimes you got to mix it up a little bit, keep people guessing. Anyway, welcome to Drive Time drive timers. I haven't called you guys that in a while, but I'm bringing it back. Tactical Tuesdays, we're going to talk about, I talk a lot about state, state of being, mixing up the state, doing sprints in the office, whatever it takes, quick jabs in the car to get you kind of out of your rut, out of your neurological pathway that's kind of just, you're, you've always been on it. Um, I heard this uh, Duggar, Steve Duggar, uh, told me a while back, or I read it, or I think he pointed me at a book that I read it in where you know the brain makes neurological pathways that, that you continue to fall into, kind of like troughs in your brain, where it's the patterns, habits, right? And you just continue to, look, it's just easier to travel down those than to travel somewhere else or do a different decision or make a different choice. So um, as you dig these troughs in your head, uh, you get stuck in them because it's really easy to slip back into that same pattern again. And I don't know if any of that's true, but it sounds awesome, right? Like, can you imagine like these little troughs in your brain where you have your neurons running down the path and they're like, I don't wanna go over here, it's easy. I don't know, but I think that's awesome. And uh, Duggar, if you know what I'm talking about, cause you normally are, you normally do, um, give me a link or something, cause that, that's, I wanna get back into that, figure out what I'm talking about. But changing your state really helps. So for example, I am a huge advocate against working from home. I just hate it. I hate working from home because there are very few people that can actually do it functionally. Um, because you just get in that state. The home state is a relaxed state. And especially if you haven't worked from home before ever, then you're like, this is going to be the greatest thing ever. Pajamas and hot tea and coffee. And, and then you do nothing. Like super unproductive. Nothing happens. You're like on the internet. You're like, oh, this is fun. And you do nothing. So I think the state of yourself is extremely important. So here are some tactics that I would think would be beneficial to anybody that's out there to produce a result. Okay, number one, uniform. You gotta be in your game time uniform, game day uniform. I mean, look, we've all done these little rituals growing up, right? Like uh, in high school, basketball season, volleyball season, game day, the athletes wore a tie or a letterman's jacket, which was sweet because we were bringing them back. I'll wear a letterman's jacket on the show coming up because. I wear it around and my friends hate me because it's humiliating to them, but not to me because I don't get humiliated anymore. Eat it. So Letterman's jacket, ties, and every day you, you, know, you saw your teammates in ties, you knew it was game day, right? And then what do you wear when you go to compete? Uniforms, right? It's all about getting in that mindset. That stuff triggers mindset. So what are you wearing to work? Okay, and so I'll, I'll throw out there for you, like, hey, some people strap that tie on. I'm telling you, put the tie on and it changes the game. When I put on a collared shirt, it's a different game. It's work time. I don't wear these shirts to go out and hang out and have a good time. I wear them to work. And so um, it's, it's an amazing state changer. So think about it. What are you wearing right now? Is it your game day? Are you going to one of the most important interviews today that you possibly have? And if you are not going to one of those interviews, why aren't you wearing the same thing? Why aren't you wearing the, your best power outfit? Seriously, get in the state. There's no reason not to be in that state. And if you're not in that state, just, okay, fine. Tomorrow, just take, take this in. Realize what I'm saying is gold nuggets and put on the power outfit, you know, whatever it's gonna be. I'm telling you, it makes a big difference and it will change how your mind focuses. Wow, almost a car accident. That's awesome. The person's upset. So, what are you wearing? Okay, what's your hair like? Did you get done right? Are you all there? You know, if you're not there, you're not in the right state and that's just a tactic you're missing out on. Use it to your advantage. Don't, don't just ignore that it exists or pretend it doesn't or pretend you're somehow like immune to it. I'm gonna get hit right now. We're going for it. Get the right state going. All right, now I've gotten a, a, a few drive time requests coming up. Uh, I had one for a dance party in the drive time. It's gonna be hard to pull off, but you know what? I'll rise to that challenge because that sounds worth it. So we will have a dance party and I'll figure out how the hell to do that without killing myself. And my mother, if you're watching, I'll be safe. Don't worry about it. 
So I'll work on the drive time, the dance drive time. And uh, other than that, I mean, uh, uh, if you have any viewer emails, send them in because it's time. I'm ready for them. It's ready for, I, I, I'm out of my last batch of viewer emails, so I need some more. And uh, yeah, so check your state out today, guys. See, this, this is a punch card for me to get into my office. You guys are seeing new things right now. Come on. Ugh. Yeah, we're live. Let's just do it. Now we're going to be in the dark tunnel. So change your state. Be aware of your state. What are you dressed up as? Put on your armor. Get into the battlefield. You don't show up to the battlefield without your armor on. You don't do that. So why would you do that in regular life? You know? That's what I'm saying. You know. All right, so send me some requests. I'll get a dance party going. It got really dark. You guys rock. See you tomorrow.